Hey everybody and welcome back to Misfit Corner Scams. This is the artist knows Andrew speaking and it's time for another scam call. Now, I haven't gotten these in a very long time. These are the student loan scams where they're calling you to help you with financial aid for your student loans. Uh, how do I know this is a scam? Well, number one, I don't have any student loans. I never have had any student loans. Number two, they don't ask for anybody. They didn't say, hey, is John Smith there? They just immediately say, do you have student loans? And if you say yes, they go into it. Now this time, I gave them some fake information, and I guess I estimated too high on the income part because uh, he hung up after that. So, so I know for sure uh, not to go so high with the uh, income next time. But I did call the number back, and you'll see that it is, once again, proof that it's a scam. But uh, if you ever get calls like this, hang up on them or screw with them like I do. Enjoy the call, and I'm absolutely sure there's going to be more coming. Oh? Yeah, hi, sir. This is Brian calling you from Student Loan Forgiveness Center. How are you doing today? Oh, very good. Okay, sir. Perfect. So this call is in regards to the Student Loan Forgiveness Program offered by the Department of Education, and I believe you have a student loan. Is that correct, sir? I do have one I'm still paying on. It's currently on hold due to the COVID... Um, they gave us a little bit of relief from the COVID stuff, but it does start no problem, being back due again soon, so. No, no problem, sir. Do we have a student loan? Yes, I have a student loan. I just said that. Okay, sir. So how much you owe in student loan? Uh, I think it's $8,000 and something. I haven't looked at it in a while. Like I said, there's currently not a, there's not a payment due. Yes, that's what I just said. Are you, can you not hear me? Hello? Hello? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. So let me ask qualified questions. Are you still in school or inactive any bankruptcy? No, I'm not in school currently and I am not in any active bankruptcy. So what is your family size, including yourself? Uh, it's just myself. Okay, you're solo? Solo? Yes, okay. it's just me by myself. Okay. What's my what? I'm sorry? Your annual gross income. How much you make in a year? You can give me a rough estimate. Uh, around 32000 a year. 32000 Are you supporting anybody in your family? No, not currently. I, I'm, I'm by myself right now. I was living with my parents, but I don't live with them anymore. I'm, I'm going to need you to repeat the question. I didn't understand what you just said. No, sir. I'm saying you, are you supporting anybody in your family? Am I supporting anybody in my family? No, like I just said, I'm, I'm by myself. I was living with my parents, but I moved out a while ago. So it's just me, by Why myself. So you are not only for this student loan forgiveness program, because your annual gross income is so much high. Oh, Really? So I can't get any assistance? <laughs> oh, what an idiot. Oh, that was fun. Hey, let me let me check that number. Hey, let's call that one back. Let's call it back. The number you've dialed is not in service. Oh no. Check the number and dial again. Or dial six one one for customer assistance. Message N E two Zero One M A fifty three. Damn, that sucked. I haven't gotten the student loan calls in a long time. Normally, I would just tell them, I don't have a student loan, which, by the way, I don't. I made that all up, hoping to see what else they would say. But 32000 a year is too much to get assistance. I'll have to remember that. Next time they call, I'll have to lower it. What do you guys think? 5000 2000 a year? <laughs> we'll give it a shot. Hey everybody, and thanks a lot for checking out the video. If you like the content, click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notification. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. Thumbs up, thumbs down, either way, and we'll catch you all next time.